All right, gonna try this out here. Gonna try, um, I guess some 2020 Bowman uh, solo pack. Uh, it's been a while since I opened on YouTube. Um, I open a ton of stuff still. Um, let's see, I'm trying to go for some, I guess Jeremy Pena would be the, the hottest guy right now in 2020 Bowman. I have the old Beckett, not the, I have the 2020, no, this is probably the newest one. 20, this one. I can't see it, this one. I have this Beckett. And, you know, obviously prices are a little bit off. You can get some Julio Rodriguez in here as well. Um, not his first Bowman. Jeremy Payne is the only first. But there's a lot of good things we can get. Um, you get the two... Two 12 card packs and one 5 card pack of the camos. Alrighty. I mean, the odds are still, I mean, pretty hard. Even though this came before the, the big pandemic boom, pretty much. This was like one of the things that was flying off the shelf. I mean, I've opened a ton of this, and I must say, I haven't had too many colors. Off, I mean, I'm saying, if you rip $2,000 worth, I might have had two, three autos in like uh, 20 colors. So 100 bucks per color. <laughs> That's not, odds aren't very good. Okay, Let's see, Joey Votto, probably future Hall of Famer. Sterling Castro, he's still pretty young. Well, not anymore, but 32. I mean, he just kind of fell off an oar. Okay, Glaber, Nico Horner. Okay, that's a guy who I think is going to be pretty good. Well, this was a good card back in 2020, but I don't think anybody really cares about him anymore. I guess he hasn't been doing too well in the minors. Okay, here's a guy who potentially will be up and help the Orioles. Mm, don't know who that is. <laughs> Aaron Ashby, I like him. I hope he gets stretched out and pitches a lot more. Another guy I don't know. Well, born in 2000, so he's still pretty young. Alright, Serger, future Hall of Famer. Altuve, I'm a Phillies fan, so, you know, I'm cheering for them in the world, Phillies in the World Series. And Luis Robert Rookie, you know, he hasn't been living up to his big hype, but hmm, he's still pretty young. He just turned 25, so, I mean, if these guys haven't, you know, started doing anything by 30, you know, if they're not up by 25... I uh, pretty much almost can give up on him, but some guys get called up 27, have a good seven-year career, and that's it. All right, Buster Posey. He, he could probably make the Hall of Fame. Here's a guy, this guy was called up young. I mean, so he'd be 27 still? Man, he's been around a long time. I thought he would be doing better but he kind of fell off Xander he's he's good uh you know he's you know gonna get to his tail end of his career 30 now all right this is a prospect that I have been collecting Luis Patino you know some of these guys guess get in the wrong organization so Tampa Bay they should be able to help him out a lot he's from Colombia I wonder if a lot of these guys will be in the world baseball classic which will be cool I think, um, I wonder if they'll make cards for that. I did see that they make these tins for the Japanese league, or they're inserted in these tins, the cards. Reese Hines, don't know him. Here's Nova again. I mean, you know, like I said, he's still young. Eric Perdino? Nope. Oh, Kelnick, he, he's been not so good. Um... I don't want to say a bust because, like, he's he's young too, 23. 
and Joe Ryan. There's a first Broman Chrome Joe Ryan. I would say he's been pretty good. Austin Nola. Aaron Nola's brother. He had a good postseason. Got that crucial hit off of him in the NLDS. Um, like I said, I'm a Phillies fan, so didn't like that. Logan Allen. He's okay. And Justin Dunn. I think he's in Cincinnati now. So, I mean, you never know. Let me see. How old is he? He's in 1995. Eh, if you guys know anything about these prospects, you know, let me know. Well, I try to look some of them up. I know fall ball's going on, and I've looked up some guys. Speaking of which, I was bidding on Harry Ford. I saw a Ray Wave and a Bowman Sapphire, and they were only $3 at the time with a, not much time left. But they're going for pretty good money. I think he's in fall ball right now. All right, another top prospect. He was in the surgery trade, Josiah Gray. Yeah, he's still young. Royce Lewis, he was definitely a top prospect, but I'm pretty sure he's still pretty young. Yeah, he's still young, born in 99. Still have a chance to see him out there. I wonder, I think he might have played some this year. Jesus Sanchez, I've seen a lot of him play here and there. Evan White, I mean, Mariners are stacked. I'm pretty sure he's still on the Mariners. I don't know why I thought he was on the Padres for some reason, but the Mariners... Um, Marco Luciano. Yeah, I guess it's, um, Crawford's pretty much getting up there. Oh, there you have it. There's a solo of Bowman just trying to test out the camera and the angles and see if it uploads correctly. But, you know, I do sell a lot of Macari. Um, what app wants me to join them? Um... We'll see. I mean, I don't know what your guys' thoughts are on Macari or what app, but they're definitely, uh, I mean, I use Macari. I think it's just the easiest one to go. And I seem to get higher prices when I'm selling on there. And But also, you can find stuff and get lower prices. So, I don't know, I'll leave a link for that below, um, I guess. You know, you could sign up and test it out, and I think you get, you can get up to like $50 free in credit on there. Like, 10 bucks if you sign up and buy something the first time and then like $30 if you list something and sell it so it's pretty good check it out um, I'm definitely gonna be open a lot more you can see in the background I have some other boxes I mean there's 2019s with the Tatises and Guerreros and I got more 2020 Bowman I got some mega boxes some update I also have football I have a over here a hanger box of 2020 prism for checkers um i have some basketball some 1920 basketball i got a 20 i got this box over here that's a pretty cool box um plus i have a big ups shipment coming tomorrow with a lot of old school stuff so if you like early early 2000s late 90s i have a, a bunch of stuff coming in to rip to show you guys so hope you enjoy uh this is just kind of a test run uh, i'll see how it works out and uploads Thanks for watching, guys.